Good day viewers and thanks for tuning in to Polymer Update TV, the world's first and only TV network with the free petrochemicals news show. You are watching the petrochemical market synopsis with me, Pratiksha Jaipal. It's Wednesday, March 30th. Let's start with energy and feedstock news. Crude oil prices declined by 2% on Tuesday on positive Russia-Ukraine peace talks coupled with possible demand decline in China. Brent futures slipped by $2.25, settling at $110.23 per barrel, while WTI futures plummeted by $1.72, settling at $104.24 per barrel. Open spec NAFTA prices dropped by $7 US dollars per metric ton to $974 US dollars per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels. Moving on to the Asian market updates for PP, PE and PVC. In PP, this week, PP prices witnessed a rise in Far East Asia, Southeast Asia and Pakistan. The price gain was on the back of stronger import offers from overseas suppliers and tight product availability in the region. Reports of higher upstream propylene feedstock values and PP futures on the Dalian Commodity Exchange further contributed to the price rise. In HDPE, this week, HDP prices declined in the Far East Asia and India. The price drop was a result of lower import offers from overseas suppliers and bearish buying sentiments in key markets like China. Weaker upstream energy values further supported the price drop. In PVC, this week, despite weaker upstream energy values, PVC prices were assessed stable in Asia. Buying sentiments were reported to be steady in the region. Over to plant news. Kayo Ethylene has brought on stream its cracker in Chiba, Japan. The company resumed operations at the Cracker on March 27, 2022, following a turnaround. Earlier, the Cracker was expected to resume operations on March 16, 2022, but failed to restart due to power outage caused by an earthquake. The Cracker was shut for maintenance on January 24, 2022. Located at Chiba in Japan, the Cracker has an ethylene capacity of 768,000 metric ton per year and propylene capacity of 450,000 metric ton per year. Our special newsreel today is sponsored by Surat-based MRK Industries LLP, one of the largest sellers of packaging films in India. MRK Industries LLP offers a full range of packaging films from 7 to 70 microns, which includes BOPP films, CPP films, Majlis films and PT films. If you like our video, don't forget to click on the bell icon to subscribe to our free news channel and like this video by giving us a thumbs up. It motivates us to continue to bring you this free informative news service on a daily basis. That's all for today's Polymer News. Watch our daily news video tomorrow to know more. This is Polymer Update with me, Pradeeksha Jaipal from Mumbai. Many thanks for watching.